Kua pūrero ake e tahi o ngā rangatira Māori o te motu ki te whakahe i te apure tai moana ka whakatūria ki ngā moutere o rangitāhua. Hei tā te kā wanatanga e tikana ki a tāwharautia te rā takiwā o te moana ki a toitū tonu ai. Engari hei tā ngā rangatira a iwi kei te ūkui a ketia ngā tika o te iwi Māori ki ngā rawa o reira. Nei rā a eruera rerekura. Kei te tautoko e nei rangatira i te whawhai o te ohu kai moana kia pupuritia e ngā iwi o rātou tikanga hi ika ki te moana o rangitāhua. We'd like to see them back off the New Zealand government and reject the pressure that's been put on them and to stand up and stand by the agreements which previous national government solemnly entered into in the full spirit of those agreements. Ia ai ki a tipine a Regan, ko rāhui tia kētia taua takiwā o te moana ki te aukati i te pūhoro i ngā ika. In the Kermadex, we've already got a completely protected 12-mile wide marine reserve zone right around all the islands. Agreed to, supported and largely driven by Māori interests. Hei tā tēnei paua nō ngaitahu, mēnā ka whakamanahia tēnei rāhui, ka whati ngā oati nō mai rā nō. This proposition in the Kermadex traduces all of that, those agreements and those behaviours, and sets a clear indication of a forward path across a wider spectrum of New Zealand's resources. Aha koa kei te harikoa ngā rōpū pū tai ao, pera i a pū, me te minita mo te tai ao a Nick Smith ki te rāhuitanga o rangitāhua, te aro mai e nei rangatira. What we're saying is we're distinctly underwhelmed by it. And if they are thrilled to bits with the Kermadec decision, I suggest to you they're not terribly well informed about the Kermadecs any more than they are about the other areas that are lying in wait for similar treatment. E matapaiana a tā tipine, ka rāhuitia e te hiwahi o te moana e te kāwanatanga, katiana ngā tikanga hi ika a ngā iwi. Iruere rerekura, te karere.